So in the past on this channel, I've talked about ways to make money and I've talked about affiliate marketing a lot. And this year, I think affiliate marketing is the best way to make money online. And I'm saying this because I've been doing affiliate marketing for some time and it's easy, it can make you a lot of money and it's scalable because there isn't really a limit on how much money you can make here. Now, if you don't know exactly what affiliate marketing is, let me give you the definition. And also affiliate marketing isn't the same as MLM and affiliate marketing is also not a scam. Affiliate marketing is the process by which affiliates earn commissions for marketing another person's or company's products. The affiliate simply searches for a product that they enjoy. They then promote that product and then they earn a piece of the profits from each sale they make. So this would be like me searching for the best bank accounts and then finding the SoFi money account. I then promote the account and when people sign up, then I get a commission. That's all there really is to affiliate marketing. Now, if you want to get started in affiliate marketing, I'm going to be talking about some resources that you can use to become an affiliate for any product or service that you can think about. Now, if you're new to the channel or you're watching one of my videos for the very first time, my name is Ian and I post the videos here on YouTube every single day on topics relating to making money and personal finance. So if you'd like to see more of these videos, then give this video a thumbs up. I'll really appreciate it. And also consider subscribing to this channel and turning on all the notifications. And that way you'll be able to get the updates every day when I post a new video here. Also drop me a comment below and let me know if you have actually ever done affiliate marketing before. And if you have, or you currently do, comment and let me know just how much money you were able to make from affiliates in one single month. Now, when it comes on to having an online business or creating a second or third stream of income online, there is no question that that's a very good way to make money easily. Now, the easiest way to make money right now is on the internet. If you have zero skills, you can watch a free video or read a free ebook and you'll be able to pull this off. Now, when I started doing affiliate marketing, I had no experience and no prior knowledge. Now, I didn't really take affiliate marketing seriously until last year when I decided that I wanted to see how much money I could make from it. And after experimenting with different affiliate programs, which were all free and also advertising these affiliates for free as well, I realized that this could generate a full-time income for me or I could either just have another stream of income or it could even replace your nine to five job. So I truly believe that affiliate marketing is the best way to make money online this year. And let's talk about what affiliate marketing entails. Affiliate marketing is when you promote someone's product or service and get paid a commission. This means that the product or service isn't yours and isn't owned by you. In fact, when you refer people to these affiliates, they will leave your platform and then they'll be taken to the owner's platform. Now, this is good for one, because you don't have to create anything. And secondly, you don't have to handle any customer support issues, no returns and no exchanges. Another good thing here is that most affiliate programs will keep cookies. Now cookies, not the ones you eat. You can think of them as tracking your activity on the internet. Each time you visit a website, cookies are saved. If you have someone click on an affiliate link and they choose not to purchase the product or service, but then in two weeks or a month or even six months in some cases, they go back to that same website and they make a purchase, you can still get paid a commission because the affiliate program or website stored the cookies and it remembers who actually referred them in the first place. Now, this is just one good thing about affiliates. Another reason I like this online business idea so much is because you have every product you could possibly think of. You can become an affiliate of eBooks, electronics, tools, vacations. I mean, even the mobile phone service you use most likely has an affiliate program, or at least you can find one. So if you were passionate about, let's say health and fitness, and you wanted to create your own clothing line and water bottles and gym bags and all this stuff, you could, it would cost you some money to start that business, even though you did it online. But with affiliate marketing, you can search for products that are very similar to what you wanted to create and then just promote them instead. This way you don't handle any payments. You don't handle customers. All you do is promote the products and you get paid every single month. It's that easy. I mean, look at your favorite YouTubers or even social media influencers. 
Most of them, if not all, have some affiliate links to products or services. These people aren't just doing this for no reason. They do it because it's very easy or a very easy way to get paid five, 10, $15,000 every month by simply recommending a product or service and having people make purchases. Now, you may be saying, well, Ian, this is a very good idea, but why should I do affiliate marketing? Why not just create my own brand or product and sell it because that way I get more profits from each sale. And if you're thinking about it like that, then yes, you are correct. You do have a point, but I've already done that. And I can tell you that although you can make more money per sale with your own products, affiliate marketing is still better because you can scale it faster, easier, and you'll have a lot less work to do. So for example, if I want to find a water bottle that's reusable, that saves the environment and costs $10, and I can get paid 60% in commissions, then I could market that water bottle. I could also create my own, which may cost me two to $3 if I do it in bulk. So here, the difference could be what? Three or $4 per sale. If I had to build this brand up, the startup cost and the time invested in marketing wouldn't be worth me making $3 more per bottle. I could promote the already established business and I wouldn't have any startup costs, or even if I did, they would be minimal. I wouldn't have to spend hours and days working on this business and I could quickly move on to another affiliate program or some other stream of income that I wanted to create. Also, think about it like this. If I stand on the side of the road and I try to sell my reusable water bottles, then I could sell maybe $100 per day because I'm a very good salesman. However, on the internet, I could sell a thousand per day easily. Think about your favorite YouTuber or social media influencer, for example. Each time they make a post, they get what? 100,000, maybe 200,000 reactions to that post. If only 10% of those people use the affiliates they talked about, then they would have what? 10, 20,000 people using their affiliate links each time they made a post. This is why I've been saying that $1,000 or making an extra $1,000 per month is not a lot of money if you have an online business. I've seen that you can make five, 10, $15,000 on a good day from the internet. And I want you guys to really think about this, right? If you try to do affiliate marketing right now where you have no startup cost, you don't need any money upfront and it won't take up a lot of your time, what do you really have to lose? The answer is nothing. Instead, you may just end up being another person added to the list of people who make three to $7,000 on average every single month from affiliate marketing. Think about some online gurus as well. My online guru friends all have a course where they want you to spend what? $999, which they say they will teach you how to become a millionaire or start a successful business or whatever it is they say now. But if you clicked on these links, most times you'll realize that the courses they're selling aren't actually their courses, meaning they were never the creator of these courses. I found this out because I found the same affiliate programs or networks with the same courses. See, if I can sell 10 courses per day at $999.99, which is very realistic by the way, and I get paid 40% in commissions, this means that in a week I'll be averaging what? About, I think, $27,000. See, these guys are making almost six figures every month from affiliate marketing. Now, of course, I'm not telling you to just go and find the most expensive product and then try to get people to sign up for it. I mean, if you want to make money, you can do that. It's probably unethical, but it's 100% illegal, so you can do it. But the main point here is that I've studied what the affiliate marketers are doing, and I've also started taking affiliates seriously this past year, and I have been able to make money from affiliates without it costing me anything. So for this reason, I think it's the best way to make money online this year. Now, if you want to get involved in affiliate marketing, I would first start by looking at products or services you already use, and you should do this because you already have an account with them, and so all you really need is an affiliate link. This is also the best place to start in my opinion because you'll already use the products or services and you'll know a lot about them. So for example, maybe you use Chime Bank or the Chime Banking app and you really like it. All you have to now do is to tell people about it and if they sign up, I think it's about $100 that you get. Now similarly, if you use some service like Mint Mobile or even Amazon because 
Amazon is where everybody shops now, then you can get an affiliate link. And based on my experience, Amazon pays about 5% in commissions on average. So if people use your links and you get on average about $10,000 in sales per week, then that's $500 in commissions for you. And if you think that's a lot of money, then think about how much people spend on Amazon. The people you know right now, what do they purchase on Amazon and how much money in total do you think that they spend on Amazon every week? Most likely it's going to be upwards of $1,000 combined. Think about all the other people in your state or in your country that spend like them on a weekly basis on Amazon. See, when you look at it like this, you will realize that although you know maybe only 10 people who shop on Amazon every week, there are one, two, three, 10 million more people who can come across your links and use it and you'll get paid commissions. So think about any products or services you currently have that may have an affiliate program. Now another pro to using affiliate marketing to make money this year is that it works anywhere. There are no state limits, no country limits, no continent limits. Wherever you are in the world is irrelevant here. You still get to promote affiliates and you still get to make the same money in commissions. So if you want the easiest way to make money this year, I would recommend you look into affiliate marketing. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and click the notification icon so you get notified. Give this video a thumbs up. I'll really appreciate it. Check all the links down below in the description and I hope to see you guys tomorrow.